Hey guys, Roseanne and Steve here, back to uh, Bantam, day three. Steve is getting ready to take his Jeep out on the playground. So getting some air and, airing down action going here. Yep, airing down the tires. What do you think, baby? You super excited today? Heck yeah, it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome. Finally get it dirty. Yep. We're just gonna do a before shot of this beautiful Jeep. He's got a little bit of dirt on it just from driving around here. But it's going to get even more dirty. Maybe mine will too. Who knows? Let's see if we have some time. It's got a little dirt going on here. Not quite enough though. dirt lane first. We're going dirt lane, all right. Not sure what this is gonna mean, but it looks like you just go up and over. Ooh. Oh my gosh, you're going up this hill. <laughs> oh, you have the sway bar thing too. Mm -hmm. That's gotta be the Rubicon thing, huh? Yeah, I'm not gonna bother with that quite yet. A that steep was one, wasn't really it? steep. I was getting <laughs> kind of nervous over here with my fear of heights and all. Now would be the time when I would want a front facing camera. Oh, yeah. Okay. 
You're so calm and cool. <laughs> I'm like freaking out over here. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> I don't know if I could do this with my Jeep. <laughs> I'm probably going to freak out because this is just to get on the playground, right? Or is this a separate thing? This is the so, But you have to go to this to get to the mud pit, probably, right? Well, no, the mud pit's a different lane. Oh, so it's based on lanes. Okay. So cool. <laughs> <laughs> Take note of the size of his smile. I love it when he smiles big oh, like this. Awesome. It's over already. We gotta go back in line. That was it? That was it. Oh my gosh. It's all for that lane. For that lane. Okay. Having fun? Oh yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh my gosh, look at all that mud. Get it, babe. Just send it. Well, this is, I know. This is a part of <laughs> I love it. All right, so which which lane was that, babe? Uh, that was the, it said dirt on it. The dirt lane. The dirt lane. Yeah. Okay. So was that fun? Heck yeah, it was fun. Were you nervous? No. Not really. When you, when you see all the other Jeeps go through it and you know, Jeeps that are, uh, you know, have smaller tires than mine and a little less lift. It's like, okay, well, if they made it through fine, mine's not going to have a problem. So that's yeah. my philosophy. So, but see, you have the Rubicon stuff. If I try to take my Sahara through, I don't have all that stuff. Like, I don't have lockers and. But you have limited sway stuff. bar and. I mean. Let's be honest, even if I had those, I'm not sure I would know what to do with them. I'd have to have my mechanic show me, my sexy <laughs> mechanic show me what to do with them. I'd figure it out, you right? Fi you figure it out, just like you always do. Can you tell the ride is a little squishy now? It's like, uh -huh. I have the front sway bar disconnected. Oh. Is that what that does? Yeah. It makes it move Dis around. It disconnects it so it allows your suspension to articulate more. So in a Rubicon, right there is where it's all done. Up we go again.
You're a pro at this, babe. What are we gonna do next? Well, I'm gonna have you drive <gasps> this. I'm not going over that thing that you just the, went over. The same thing? No. Yeah. No, no, no. Why don't we want to do that? No, because I am scared to death to do that. I will end up sending your Jeep into the, like, on those logs. I, Come on. You sure? I'm, babe, I will never forgive myself <laughs> if I'm this, the sad story for your Jeep. <laughs> I will happily drive it through the mud pit. <laughs> okay, well. Um... Let me see what all the other ones are first. Yeah, you're doing it. <laughs> I'm not taking no for an answer. <laughs> okay. You just remember, he's forcing me to do it. <laughs> <laughs> just be smooth on the gas. Smooth on the brakes. Don't do anything fast or quick. Keep, keep throttle, you know, keep yourself moving. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay, folks. So, here we go. Roseanne is going to be driving my Jeep through one of the obstacles here at the playground. And this one I just did three times with no problems whatsoever. It's called <laughs> dirt. And I okay. told her I am not taking no for an answer. She's going to do this. I'm scared to death. Just watch the spotters. Keep, you know, good pressure on the throttle. Keep it moving. If I should wait for this guy. I don't know. I'm gonna go around and just go around. Which one did you go in? Far Third. right. Third. Okay. Don't do anything quickly. Just slow and steady pressure on the throttle. This isn't part of the obstacle here, so. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but just to get the feel for how the Jeep bounces around and stuff. <laughs> I gotta be able to see the sky when I come up. Right. Here. You know I'm afraid of heights, right? Right. Slow and steady pressure. Keep going, keep going. Oh my gosh. My turn. Good job, hun. Have fun. You got this. Okay. You got it. <laughs> Break a little bit. Slow <laughs> down. Can I watch? Keep it straight or turn? Um, put it, take it th that way a little bit. Okay. A little bit more. Okay. 
Now go ahead and start descent, and then come to, towards me. There you go, bud. Good job, babe. This one scares me. Okay, just follow his direction. Go to the right. Passenger. Passenger. Straight. Keep going. Straight. Stay straight. Good, good. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You got this, babe. See, it's almost over. <laughs> I'm sorry, you're gonna have to adjust your seat, babe. But I really needed to see out the window. Well, oh, of course. <laughs> That was so fun, but so scary. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> okay, where am I going? All right, go down here. And... It wasn't as bad as you were thinking. Jeep made it just fine and so did you. Sorry, I had to do a little mudding there. <laughs> Thank you, man. That was fun. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Damn it, now I need a Rubicon. <laughs> oh. So we just met Sherry and... Was it Scott? Scott, yes. And... Um, where, did we, where did I meet them? Jeep Life page. Okay, Jeep Life. Facebook. And we became Facebook friends and then found out that we lived in the same area. To the right, straight. Straight. We found out that we lived in the same area and uh, that they were going to be a Bantam. And lo and behold, we were pulling over for me to switch into the driver's seat. And I'm like, who are these people in front of us and this Jeep in front of us backing up? And then I saw her get out and walk towards the Jeep, and I was like, ah, <laughs> that's who it is. Okay, I'm going to pull over so we can switch again. All right. So that Steve can uh, continue having a great time. So fun. Thank you, babe. You're welcome. This is awesome to see you having fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're trying the 33, huh? Is that I'm the one the that 33. you said that you didn't know if you wanted to do? He said it's Jersey Barriers. What are Jersey Barriers? <laughs> it's those big concrete. Uh, oh, that's so that's the one next to what we just did? Right. Or the one next to what we just did was the 35 plus. Oh. Where we saw that dude, Where you like, said you weren't sure you uh, wanted to yeah, do that? Yeah, I'm not sure I wanted He said it's not the big boulders.
<laughs> Did that scare the crap out of you? My hand's shaking. <laughs> made me a little nervous, that's for sure. <laughs> there they go! Watch you got this thing coming down. <laughs> that was kind of sketchy. <laughs> so Holy that was cow, that, that was, was boulders and tires and Jersey barriers and Jersey Jersey barriers. Yeah, Big concrete barriers. Wow. Holy crap. Yeah, going over the tires is kind of a crazy feeling, isn't it? little bit because it feels like it hits but then it squishes when all the weight gets on it's right like, yeah it's just a squishy feeling you did awesome babe thanks that was you know a little butt clenching action there for sure <laughs> <laughs> white knuckle disease we really need to get a beat up Jeep, yeah. a, be a beater Jeep, so that we can just play play with it and not not be afraid of damaging it. Yeah. All right, so we just picked up Renata. <laughs> Say hi, Renata. Hi. She's joining Life, Liberty, and Adventures today for a fun Jeep adventure <laughs> on the playground at Bantam and. We're doing, what is it, Moraine Trail? Moraine Trail this afternoon, yeah. Moraine Trail this afternoon. So, yeah. So, Holly. Super fun day. I'm going to make sure to show you where the grab bar is. <laughs> uh, now you're scaring me. <laughs> <laughs> so, you may remember, Renata was in our East Brady video. It's been a while since we've been on an adventure with Renata. It has been. Mud pit time. Mud pit time. Time to get this beast dirty. <laughs> er. Dirty. Er. <laughs> I don't I'm, know that it's that dirty right now yet. Not yet. I am going to keep the windows up when we go through the Well, yeah. Pit. Oh, okay. I guess I have <laughs> to put my window up. That was his polite way of saying, put the window back up. <laughs> put the window back up, babe. <laughs> windows going up. <laughs> So 
this Bantan's a big, big deal, it isn't is it? It is a big deal, yes. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. Oh, Lord. Take a perfectly clean Jeep and <laughs> make it all dirty. <laughs> So what's the do or do nots through here? Just hammer down? Yeah, not really. Not really? <laughs> okay. Just don't get stuck. Just don't get stuck, right? <laughs> here we go. Woo! Yeehaw! <laughs> Woo! Oh my! Oh! Oh! <laughs> nice! Nice! <laughs> what was that, babe? Oh my god, that was wicked! <laughs> Oof! And this is where you get stuck. <laughs> Coming out. <laughs> That's exhilarating! Oh yeah! <laughs> Do that again. You want to do that again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that mud. <laughs> mud oh flicking up everywhere off the tires. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> I can see in the rear view mirror the side of the Jeep is covered. I love it. Look at your smile. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> so how did you two decide to do all this? I know you bought the Jeep first. Yeah, it was uh -huh. all of Roseanne's fault. <laughs> <laughs> I know you bought your second. I, uh, <laughs> I started yeah. the addiction. Yeah, when we were test driving Jeeps for her, I fell in love with them. Like, oh my god, these are so cool. Yeah. And they drive so nice and pl uh -huh. plenty of power and and uh, I just decided to sell my Trans Am and, you know, use that to help fund it, so. Yeah. If I wouldn't have had the Trans Am to help fund it, I don't know that I would have, you know, did it right now. Right. Or, or back then. Yeah. Because it is expensive. Yeah. And yeah, I, I imagine it would be. And I didn't really need a daily driver. You know, I have a daily driver for work and stuff, so. But then we got into it, and we, we started like finding out about the Jeep community. Not and, going back now. Yeah, and uh, off-roading with these Jeeps, and and then Ooh. I think I think Renata, you're the one that uh, told us about Phantom, didn't you? Oh yeah, with um, because you Kent. were mentioning Kent and off-roading and. And then I think we just somehow stumbled into it. And of course we met Kent. And, yeah. then, and then we did our first official Jeep event. It was Trail Fest. But we in came October. here. We came here last right. year just to look around. Yeah. We had something spectators. else. Yeah, we had something else going on Saturday. Just we couldn't get here yeah. Saturday. And then uh and then so we registered my Jeep for Trail Fest back in October. And my very first ever experience off-road was their night trail. <laughs> and I remember <laughs> thinking, oh my gosh, I'm doing this at nighttime. It probably isn't the smartest thing to do Yeah, at night. but I guess what a way to break in, break myself into <laughs> if you can going do that at night. Yeah. Everything else is cakewalk. Yeah, so, and it was probably, you know, in hindsight, it was probably best that I did it at night because I couldn't see exactly how close we were to everything oh, yeah. until we did the same trail the next day oh. during the daytime. And I was like, oh my gosh, these are, these trees are so close to my Jeep. <laughs> how did I do this last night? But by then it's like, well, you already did it. So you yeah. know you can do it again. So it was good. All right. We got a line for the mud pit. Yep. A little bit of a line here. <laughs> if you get stuck, I'm not getting out of the vehicle. <laughs> <Neither am I. laughs> Woo! Go, 
baby, go! Yeehaw! Woo! Hammer down! Woo! <laughs> Hold on! Woo! Yeehaw! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Fun. Do you want to drive through the mud pit, babe? Do you trust me to? <laughs> I trusted you to do it up True. over that other thing. <laughs> yeah, You're I'll doing it. I'll do it. I'm not taking no for an answer. <laughs> That's the second time I've heard that today. He's getting kind of bossy. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. <laughs> All right, babe, what are you doing now? We're going through the mud. <laughs> what a fun time. Did you ever imagine you would be doing this stuff? No. Not, <laughs> never. <laughs> oh, I gotta love the Jeep life. See, look at this one in front of us. It's a sport with the tires are on it look like street tires. If he can get through it, there's no reason why your Jeep can't get through, babe. Okay. Well, if we have time, let's freaking do it. Let's fucking send it. Right. <laughs> Actually, let me get yours through it first, and then I'll say. <laughs> Just watch that guy. Then <laughs> you'll make your decision. <laughs> oh, piece of cake. Piece of cake. Okay, so I push this down. Top up. Of this. Up. Oh, up. Okay. Okay. Good. Yep. We're good. All right. Let's do it. Hammer down. I know you know how to do hammer down. <laughs> that was hammer down. That was hammer down. Nice. Thank you. Good job, babe. So fun. <laughs> oh my gosh, I gotta do it again. <laughs> so we are in Roseanne's Jeep on the playground and what's she going to do? I'm going through the mud. We're gonna get this baby muddy, finally. It's time to get mine muddy. Sounds good to me. You gotta you got to yeah, you got to I'm good? Yep. All right. Have fun. Thank you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Here we go. Keep the hammer down. Don't stop. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Shit, I didn't turn that on. Damn it. And I got a duck down between my feet. <laughs> I guess that means we got to go through it again, right? We do. <laughs> and keep stay on this side. Up on the high side. Yeah. Oh, can't. I can't because there's a jeep there. Yeah. Oh my god, look at them. <laughs> Covered in mud. Crazy girl. So if they use this as a trail for new four-wheel drive people, it can't be that bad. So we are getting ready to go out on the trail for Moraine. It's the Moraine trail? Tra Moraine trail ride. Moraine trail ride. So uh, we have a ways to go before we get to the actual trail, but We've had a good day so far. We've gotten nice and muddy in the Jeeps and stopped and had a little lunch break. Ate a lot of unhealthy food, but it was tasty. It was delicious. And uh, what else have we done? Oh, we took a, we stopped and got some Jeep selfies yep. with our muddy Jeeps.
have to go back in way deep in the woods that you know normal cars and stuff can't get to. Yeah. And see things that normal normally people wouldn't, can't see. You wouldn't see. <laughs> Renata, have you ever been back here? Uh uh, I have not. This is new for you. Yep. It's cool. I thought she was going to say, yeah, around this bend, so and so lives right over here. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Renata knows everybody. Renata's been living here for a lot of years, right? Almost 65 years. Our entire life. She is the one to hang out with if you want to know the tea about anybody. <laughs> Not that she discloses anything, she doesn't. <laughs> She's just very knowledgeable. Look at these uh, swampy areas over here. Uh -huh. I don't think they're like I'm... lily pads for swamp frogs. I don't think I want to take my Jeep thing. in there. <laughs> You'd probably never get it back out. I was going to say, I don't think it would get out <laughs> without a, some heavy equipment. That's big wheels in the I wonder what lives in that little swamp. <laughs> Anything that wants to. Anything that wants to, right? Snakes. Ew, probably. Bugs. Lizards. Lizards. Bugs. Do we have lizards up here in prison? I don't know. Do we have lizards? I don't know. <laughs> sounded good. Sounded oh. good. Crocodiles. <laughs> wrong state. Yeah, wrong state. It looks like crocs could live in there. It does. You guys don't know. You haven't been in there swimming, right? <laughs> no, not recently. <laughs> I'm sure nobody else does either, which is why we don't know if there's crocs in there. What do they do in the wintertime when it freezes over? They swim to Florida. They swim all the way to Florida. <laughs> okay. She's a great just, storyteller. Just so I'm clear on that, because oh. I was always wondering what the crocodiles do. <laughs> <laughs>